Quantum entanglement. Do you believe everything is connected, monkey? Quantum entanglement defies even the most sacred rules of physics. As far as we know, nothing can travel faster than light. But when it comes to quantum entanglement, everything we know so far gets mixed up. Even if two particles are light years apart, a measurement made on one seems to instantly affect the other. I know it sounds very complicated, monkey. Fortunately, by the end of this video, we will have a simpler understanding of this chaos, which even confused Einstein and led him to call it spooky action at a distance and its real life applications. In the quantum world, Particles don't behave like independent. They're like different hands of a bunch of bananas. When you look at one, you learn about the roots of the other. Monkey is confused. Is there an invisible banana string connecting them? Not exactly monkey, but that's a common misconception. What quantum entanglement suggests, maybe the reality is not as separate as we think. Monkey's eyes widen. Explain. With bananas, to understand quantum entanglement, first imagine this scene, monkey. There are two bananas in front of you. These bananas are so special that even if they are separated from each other, they still have a form of communication. When you open one, if the inside is yellow, the other will definitely be red. If one turns to the right, the other instantly turns to the left. Monkey thinks, but my bananas are always yellow. This doesn't happen in the normal world, monkey. You know what's inside your banana even before you look, but not in the quantum world. Particles are uncertain until they are measured. It's as if they are both yellow and red, turning both right and left at the same time. And the magic begins at the moment of measurement. When you look at one, the other's properties are instantly determined. This instant determination is the basis of entanglement. The two particles are no longer separate of each other. They are two different ends of a single quantum state. Monkey understands, so there are no longer two two bananas, but two sides of one banana? Exactly. That's why scientists are so fascinated by entanglement, because this phenomenon suggests that there is an invisible conductor orchestrating the particles together in the depths of nature. Monkey gets confused. Monkey likes the video and writes in the comments what he thinks is happening. Monkey asks, so bananas communicate faster than the speed of light, but light was the fastest thing in the universe? Yes, monkey, the laws of physics still say so. That's the strange thing. According to classical physics, in information or influence must travel a distance, and the fastest way is the speed of light. But in quantum entanglement, it seems that particles don't need to send messages to each other. Even if they are kilometers or even light years apart, they seem to respond at the same time. Monkey's eyes widen. So one particle is here, the other is there, but they still decide at the same time. This is really like magic. Yes, monkey. Entanglement might seem like magic, but science believes in experiments, not magic. Einstein didn't trust these initial observations. He saw two possibilities. Either quantum mechanics was incomplete and the colors of these bananas were already determined before we looked at them, meaning we were just learning about an already existing reality. Or the most fundamental rules we know, such as the speed of light limit, must be wrong. Otherwise, instant communication between particles so far apart would be impossible. This is called the EPR paradox. If such an instant connection really existed, our classical understanding of the universe, the idea that everything is separate, independent, and only affected by things close by could not be correct. Experiments conducted by scientists later gave results different from what Einstein had expected. Quantum mechanics was correct. Particles really did behave entangled. But this does not mean faster than light communication. It simply shows that the universe is much more connected than we thought. Monkey gets really excited. He checks the comments to read what other monkeys think and exchange ideas to better understand this complex phenomenon together. Monkey asks, how did they prove something that cannot be seen? This is where John Bell enters the scene with a clever mathematical test he developed, Bell's inequalities. If the behavior of particles is determined by hidden properties, the results of the test should not exceed certain limits. But if entanglement truly existed, those limits would be exceeded. And when the experiments were conducted, monkey, the limits were exceeded. In tests conducted, particles behaved differently than Einstein had imagined. So they did not have unmeasured properties. They were truly entangled. Monkey turns the telescope toward the laboratory. Small photon pairs are sent and the detectors click. And monkey sees entanglement is real. The scientists who conducted this research won the Nobel Prize in physics. So entanglement is no longer a speculation. It's been proven repeatedly and is one of the cornerstones of physics. Monkey is fascinated. Mm -hmm. So it's not magic. But that means if I talk to a banana, I can send messages faster than the speed of light, right? Mm -hmm. No monkey. 
But like you, this is where most people gets confused. Quantum entanglement cannot be used for information transfer because when you measure a particle, you can't control the result. It always comes out randomly, right or left, red or yellow. So it is impossible to send a message to another monkey. Another misconception is this. Entanglement shows that everything in the universe is connected. It sounds poetic, but in reality, Entanglement only applies to particles that previously shared a quantum state. So the banana in your hand is not automatically entangled with a star billions of light years away. Still, this phenomenon is fascinating enough to make us question the concept of separateness. Monkey asks, what about parallel universes? Explain. This is where things get more philosophical, Monkey. One of the most popular interpretations on this subject is the many worlds interpretation. According to this interpretation, the universe splits into two at every moment of measurement. If the inside of the banana is yellow in one universe, it must be red in the other. We cannot experience both at the same time but the quantum wave function preserves all possibilities. We only experience one of them. Monkey gets confused. So, could I be eating a red banana in another universe? Mm. Exactly, Monkey. According to this theory, every time you make a measurement, countless parallel universes branch off. Entanglement comes into play here because the strange connections between measurements are explained much more naturally with the many worlds theory. All possibilities for both particles already exist. You just experience one of them. But remember, monkey, this is just a theory. Although many physicists find this idea fascinating, we currently have no direct evidence to prove the existence of parallel universes. Entanglement does not explain this phenomenon. It just tells us to consider the possibility that perhaps something else is happening. Monkey understands. So maybe while I'm eating my banana here, in another universe, I'm unpeeling its skin. Monkey gets upset thinking his friend might be in a universe where this video doesn't exist and sends it to his friend so they could watch it too. Monkey asks, what about my bananas? What happens to them? Explain. Mm -hmm. Calm down, Monkey, your bananas are safe. But quantum entanglement is a key that will shape the future of modern technology. Quantum computers. While normal computers work with zeros and ones, Quantum computers can process multiple possibilities at the same time thanks to superposition and entanglement. This could be a huge revolution in solving incredibly difficult problems. Monkey imagines, I could discover millions of banana sources at the same time. Quantum cryptography. Communication established through entanglement can be detected immediately if eavesdropped on from outside. This is because entangled particles collapse when measured. This means unbreakable security, Monkey thinks of his banana safe. No one can hack the password of my banana safe. Quantum internet. Scientists are trying to use entanglement to send quantum information over long distances. This means an ultra secure communication network approaching the speed of light in the future. Mm. Monkey turns his telescope towards space so we can instantly find out how many bananas there are in other galaxies. Monkey thinks, are we all just pieces of one giant banana? If we look at quantum physics, yes, monkey, the invisible bond between particles seems to defy light years. What Einstein called spooky has been observed countless times in laboratories today, and it's opening doors in many fields, from future computers to secure communication systems. 